Welcome back to PRP Farms. Hope you enjoy this episode. Good morning, Supervisor. How you doing, Patches? Coming to see the puppies. Walked right into that stick, didn't I? Come here, Daisy girl. You got them all sprawled out there, Angel. They all just sprawled out, aren't they? Yep. Okay, let's go take care of the chickens real quick. Okay, well, it's moving day for the chickens. Let's see. I need to see if I can't fix my my two deals real quick hope you can see but it's cracking right across there so we're gonna try and put a couple screws in it see if we can't salvage it oh too fast let's try it this way now what the heck What? Come here. Well, kind of started splitting that away, so I'm not sure if that's going to help or make it worse. I'm fixing these handles so I hopefully I can get it to where I can move it by myself again uh, this one totally broke all the way off the other day so we're gonna see if we just can what we can do here That was last year when it happened. No, it wasn't last year. Yes, it was. It was like two weeks ago. Girl. That's your answer for everything, though, is last year, last year, last year. Do what? Nothing. Yeah, I guess today we're going to call it today moving day, I guess. As you can see, I didn't take a video of this before we put them over here, but all, a bunch of shrubs. I don't know if you can see the red stems of all the, ate all the leaves off of over here. They, they three have cleaned it up good. Ain't you, Sam? Fong. Yeah. I know, Topaz. You want to come over here and I love on you too, huh? So we are going to move them from over here today we're gonna move them over here and all this brush here and get all that cleaned up just take a little bit at a time hey everybody it's a Saturday evening here you know a few chores to do tonight this was our feed room we had all our feed cans stacked up in here. But what we have decided to do with Monica, I'm gonna cut a hole in that wall of the barn right there. Just like that one right there. With a gate. And we're gonna put a stanchion in this area here. I'm gonna pull these pallets out, move them over yonder. That's gonna be our, that's gonna be our feed room. Now, I'll move these pallets over. Now, I'll put a wooden floor, and then we'll get a rubber mat to put down here for her, and I'll bid a 
build a head deal up here with the feed trough in it. So in order to do that, I've got to come over here to this pen. And I got it. We done took a couple. We had a just a stationary rat one cage right here for rabbits. And then had some on this, had a, a series of them on this wall here, but we already had to move them out because we needed more room for feed since we got the cow and the horse and everything. So now I'm gonna pull this one out and then we'll be good to go for feed. For a new feed room at least. We can sit down here when we're getting feed. Just look out here, look at everything. Uh, Monica and Cowboy, I don't know if y'all can see I'm very good in this camera. Well, it's party time. What's up, Patches? Can y'all see the supervisor up here in screen? Come over here working. Come over here and check me out. Make sure I'm not slacking, huh, buddy? Out of here. Now, take this tarp down we had to keep it from peeing and pooping on the wall.
Yeah, well, we're making progress now. Let me get this stuff here out of here. I'm gonna start bringing some pallets in here to give us a, a little bit of a floor. Yes, now we'll see how we want to arrange. I guess now we'll see how we want to arrange our pins. One there, one goat. Let me get this other goat in here. Okay, baby. Have a good evening. That was one of my lovely granddaughters. Right oh, she was working with her pig this evening. Okay. Yes. Will be chicken feed, I think. Chicken feed there. Tell you what, if you're thinking about feed bins, I recommend just going and spending 30 bucks on a large garbage can. Of spending 30 bucks on these these are pretty but they don't hold as much that garbage can hold a lot more than this will and rats don't eat your metal garbage cans that's dog food i think i'm gonna put the dog food over here between the horse food and the alfalfa for the cows with this cat food in a minute. This is empty. I think I am gonna put my chick starter in there now. Dog food here, over here, okay. You know what? I'm gonna put my chip food over here. I'm gonna put my starter. This is game bird here for the turkeys. Starter right there. I got left. I have my calf mana left. I'm gonna have to give some thought to what I'm Okay. Let's see if we can't get something to fit in this corner right over here. Okay. 
Let's see. Hand me that calf. Oh, uh, no, don't move that calf, man. That pallet will fall on you if you do. Uh, my cup is on that uh, bucket that the alfalfa goes in. That's where it goes. Bring it in here. No, not my cup, I want the bucket. You said the cup. I said my cup is sitting on the bucket. Communication gap there, huh? I don't know what that means. It means we miscommunicated. Okay. Okay. Well, there is the semi-finished product of our new feed room. Of course, the, these three barrels right here are going to have to come over here to this side or do something because that's where she's going to be milking at eventually. Whew. Yeah, one chore partially done. Now, I just got to get all that feed out of the truck into here. And that's probably not going to happen until tomorrow. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.